Ladies here, give it up for the roof. I was gonna say, uh, I was gonna say you could have this one, but now if you feel like that chair, it's up to you. Yeah. Because you know, I just thought I was gonna like be the like special host, oh, special chair. Yeah, special host, special. You got yeah, the special, special chair. chair. Yeah. yeah Does this look right? No, you're pregnant. You can do whatever you want. No, I know a special chair for you. <laughs> Is that a present for me? I am so excited to be on right now, by the way. I have to say that this is the coolest thing in the world to be a part of. This is, yeah, I'm, I'm glad that you're the exact. Uh, this is not for you. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm very happy to be here, Jimmy, but this is a baby gift uh, for you. For uh, me already? Yes. Uh, Nobody has even got me anything. Then I must be the best person you know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is from my wife and I. Um, uh, we didn't know if it's a boy or girl, obviously, so this should work for both. But it is a uh, cardigan, or as I call it, a Cardi G. Okay. And, <laughs> oh my God, this feels weird. It feels weird. It does feel weird? What, yes. like flammable or something? What's wrong? No, 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 I mean, I think oh. she means in general. Oh, I thought you meant the material. <laughs> Oh my, babies are so little. I know. <laughs> it's very, very such little. a little Cardi G. Uh, have you guys met before? Uh, it's John cute. Cardi? No, we haven't. No, you look British. I look British? Yeah. <laughs> I think thank you. Yeah, yeah, absolutely, yeah. They're pretty popular, right? Oh, yeah, British people, of course. We they guys. play They're Americans in movies and stuff. Yeah, people yeah. like them. Yeah, like, 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 like the Pet Shop Boys. The Pet Shop Boys? I look like the Pet Shop Boys? <laughs> yeah. What made yeah, you together? Uh, do you know Cardi's music? Do you know Cardi? Are you a fan of uh, Cardi B's music? Yes, I am, yeah. of course. Uh, On your you eye. come up in my shuffle, and the, you're amongst weird company. Uh, it's a lot of my own comedy albums. Uh, <laughs> Congratulations. Some Steely Dan and nice. uh, Tom Jones. Uh, you are like a giant Tom Jones fan. I am uh, interested in Tom Jones. Uh, and I think he's very talented. Uh, but I have his music because I played a prank with a song of his years ago. Uh, when I was about 11 years old, I went to a diner that had a jukebox where for uh, $1 you got three plays. And uh, my friend and I put in $7. And then we selected 21 plays of Tom Jones's What's New Pussycat. <laughs> and then we sat down and waited. And did people just have a meltdown? They lost their minds! <laughs> <laughs> Played 11 times, then they unplugged the jukebox. Now, you think that would be a, a record, some sort of record, <laughs> or something like that, playing it, that song that many times in a row and driving humans insane? It was recently beat. Now explain this, and who is this genius? By a high school student uh, at Clark Central High School. I, I believe I'm getting that correct. His name is Gabe, uh, and he snuck into the intercom room because he did the morning announcements, and he played What's New Pussycat 22 times for 45 minutes, blasting over the school intercom, and they had to cancel school. Is he expelled? No, he got suspended for three days, and he couldn't go to prom. <laughs> well, I, I didn't think it was fair, but also, like, that's not that bad of a punishment, not going to prom. Like, no. at best, prom is like a wedding, you know? <laughs> yeah, at best, yeah. At I, best, yeah. Did, and at I worst, had a good it's prom. prom. You, you had a good prom? Mm -hmm. <laughs> really? All right. Did you have a good prom? John? No. <laughs> I've never met anyone who had a good prom. Well, you know what? <laughs> My my boyfriend at the time he dumped me two weeks before my prom. What? But I don't think is I think I honestly think it's because he didn't want to pay for the limo. <laughs> <laughs> but then that night, forget it. <laughs> <laughs> you, you don't want to get into it. But that night something he, you saw him again? No, I just. Uh... <laughs> Did someone pay for the limo? Mm. Was someone, was someone in the limo? Yeah. <laughs> you know, my Nana drove me to my prom. <laughs> but you want to know something? The yes. limo that I ended up with, I didn't rent it. You bought a limo? No, it's just, I just got in a limo and just... Took it. Forget it. I can't get into it. Kids watch me now. 
Well, you've already got us 90% of the way there. <laughs> no, 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 no. I think, no, I think we know. We could probably put two and two together. And just... So my Nana, anyway. <laughs> um... Cardi B, uh, where did that name come from? My name come from, you know what? My sister name is Hennessy. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? My sister name is Hennessy, right? So everybody used to call me Bacardi. So I always call myself Bacardi, right? And then it was my Instagram name, like Bacardi, Bacardi B. But for some reason, my Instagram keep getting deleted. And I think it was Bacardi <laughs> that had something to do with it. Mm -hmm. So I just shortened it to Cardi B. So Cardi B is the jam, and I love that. Mm -hmm. Well, now everyone's calling your name now, pal. Yeah. You are from uh, uh, from the Bronx. Mm-hmm. <laughs> are you? Sorry. Uh, are you? Uh, are you from? Uh, are you going home for the holidays? The Bronx. Yep. Oh yeah. Yes. Definitely. You are. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I follow you on uh, on Twitter. I think it's I am Cardi B, and you said that you're not getting any adults uh, gifts this year for Christmas. No, because you want to know something. Everybody that I know got kids, and this is like that's just a lot of kids. So take and, care. Of and I got new god kids out of nowhere. You know, once you start making money, everybody wants you to be their their kids' godmother. <laughs> 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 but uh, I, 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 you did get a beautiful gift. Uh, actually, a, you got a wedding ring from uh, your fiance. Uh, you're engaged to uh, Offset there from Migos. He did that live. Oh, I mean, brrr, is right. Yeah. I mean, looks gorgeous. Let me see that. Let me see that. Ring. Look at that. Ooh. Don't get too close because I ain't put no lotion on my hand. Gotcha. 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 <laughs> It's winter time. It's a winter time. I got you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Did you know? Uh, look, that is the biggest diamond I've ever seen. Did you have any idea that he was gonna do it? No. I mean, you know, I always, I always, he always just told me like, I'm gonna marry you. I'm gonna marry you, and it's just like, mm hmm. <laughs> it's the right thing to do. But I didn't know, you know, I know, I know he was gonna give me, I know, I know he was gonna give me a very expensive gift because he wasn't there for my birthday. But I thought he was gonna give me like a watch or something. <laughs> but he just, he just went out his way. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the Grammy Awards. <laughs> Grammy Awards, January 28th, here in New York City, mm -hmm. your hometown. Are you nervous? I am nervous. You want to know something? You want to know something? <laughs> yeah. I, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes. I already feel like a winner. Yeah, you already you are You know what winner. I'm saying? Because it's just like, I never thought me. <laughs> you already are. Yeah, like, you... I already won, but it's good. <laughs> <laughs> you did. I mean, you, you've been on our show a few times, but uh, Bodak Yellow was the first number one single from a female rapper since 1998. So already you just changed the game. It went three times platinum. <laughs> Everybody was singing that song. Everybody was doing it. Uh, girls, but women, men, grandmas. Everybody was singing Bodak Yellow. Yeah, I, I see. I'm so proud of myself. <laughs> <laughs> it's gotta feel good though, right? It, it does feel good and um, it feels good because you know, I really worked my ass off for it. And it's just like, ah, oh, it finally pays off. Really I have good. been proven. Right, yeah. Oh, please, you got more to come. There's more to come with you. Uh, uh, but you're also make, making some history. You're the first female hip hop artist, I wanna get this right, with uh, your first three singles in the top 10 at the same time, Cardi B! Oh. I mean, I heard that and I was like, you know, and uh, I totally was. I totally was. I didn't think I was going to be, but I was like, you know, and I just think that, it. yeah. Everyone can agree that you have one of the greatest voices, and uh, we thought there's no better way to hear someone's voice than on a voicemail. Greeting. So okay. since we have so many Cardi B fans here in the audience, we thought you could record a random, a random audience member's voicemail greeting right now. Let's pick someone out of the audience. Who wants Cardi B to record the voicemail? Look at that. Oh, oh, pink, pink sweatshirt. Standing up. Oh. Yeah, pink, yeah, come down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, go, go. 
Come on now. Come on now. Go, go, go. Yeah, absolutely. Pink. Come around this way. Party, you can have a seat over here. You look like uh, Please Drake. let me get a microphone. No, <laughs> uh, yes, I'm going to get does. a microphone for you. Here you go. This is for you. I know you have no microphone. Uh, hello. Uh, welcome. Well, hi. What is your name? Angel. Angel. Very yeah. nice. Uh, Are you Angel. Puerto Rican. Yeah. Mm. From the Bronx. You know what I'm saying? From the Bronx. <laughs> I've known the... like ten Puerto Rican angels. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'm one of kind. Yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> you are uh, a big Cardi B fan, yeah, obviously. Yeah, How big of a fan are you? I was a huge fan since she was in Love and Hip Hop and she was doing her mixtapes and this girl has done it all and she deserves everything she gets. Like, she's amazing. <laughs> she's very inspired. Yeah. She's very inspired. Yeah. <laughs> we love her. Uh, uh, Angel, you're from the Bronx? Yeah. Okay, all right. Uh, what do you do for a living? I'm a manager to Duncan. You're a manager at what? Dunkin' Donuts. Hey, yeah. no way! Yeah. Why you ain't got, why you ain't got no Dunkin' Donuts in my dressing room? I know, I'm sorry. Wait, we can call somebody. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Dunkin', I love it, man. Uh, what do you like to do for fun? Dance, sing, rap, everything. Mm. Really? Merengue, bachata, reggaeton, ya I was gonna say the same thing, but uh, <laughs> ended up not doing it. Um, what is your go-to excuse for when you can't pick up your phone? I'm doing something crazy. <laughs> <laughs> something crazy. All right, here we go. Do you have your phone with you? Yeah. And did you turn it on? I know everyone's phones are on, but yep. some people's phones are on. <laughs> All right, I can do it. All right, here we go. Ooh, hey, this is a nice iPhone. Yeah, it's a nice. <laughs> Ooh, la la, <laughs> uh, OK, you go to greeting, you go to custom, and then you go to record. All right, Be this is Angel no, from the Bronx, manager at Duncan. <laughs> He likes to dance and rap and <laughs> and then uh, when he's as go-to issues when he can't pick up the phone he's doing something crazy. All right, and you're ready? So I'll go. To, I'll count to three and then we'll record his voicemail. One. Or do you want to do it? Okay. Yeah. Hello, everybody. It's your girl Cardi B and me and Angel are doing. <laughs> and they leave your name at the after the beep. Leave your name at the end of the beep. Wait, uh, make sure we're gonna be around very thirsty, so you go make sure okay. you go to the yeah. precinct over there. Yeah, because we're gonna oh, make some bad stuff. Need some chimichurri <laughs> after. You know? oh, okay. oh, perfect. Uh, there you go. That is your voice. <laughs> Unbelievable, man. Congratulations, to Angel, right there. Cardi B is now the official voice. The voicemail greetings. Are you ready to play a game? <laughs> Are you ready? Uh, choose the first box. Audience, oh, want to help her out? No, four is my lucky number. Four. Really? Okay, all right. 11 and four. Um, all right, do you want me to help get this? I don't want to keep, keep getting up. But this is all part of the game. I can tell. Yeah, because you're trying to cheat and stuff. Right? I'm not cheating, but well, I can tell. I can tell it's very light. I can tell it's very light by the way you carried it over. <laughs> Mm. <laughs> oh, wait! Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Okay. All right. Now the audience is very. The audience is very. It's confusing me now because they. <laughs> They just had like 10 different reactions. One was, <gasps> then it was like, aww, and then it was like, ah, and then they laughed. Let me touch it. What is that again? I'm touching it. Okay, you're, you're touching it right now. It's fluffy. Mm -hmm. Or is it? <laughs> Wait, that's not, that is fluffy or is it? Uh huh. Uh, what is in your box? Not a penis. He really wants to quit. No, I know 
I'm very kidding. Winner, I love sword, you. Loser. <laughs> oh, I am so I'm ready to win. All right. So what is it? What is it? Tell me what it is. I don't know what it is. All right. <laughs> You're gonna have to make up something because I have to guess if you're lying or telling the truth. I don't know what it is. I can, I can, I can wait. I can, you can think of a name for it, and I can tell you if I think you have to know what it is. Uh, pussy balls. Are they pussy balls or not? Now, pussy balls. I'm going to say, I'm going to say you tell the truth. Let me see. Hey! <laughs> yeah, I'll take. Can you please hold my pussy ball? I, yeah, thank you. Nah, I knew that was going to happen. Okay, good. All right, I have your. All right, here we go. What number, guys? Three. All right, thank you. One person. <laughs> One person is on my side. Unbelievable. <laughs> Uh, my sister yelled out three. Yeah, perfect. <laughs> Here we go. Let's get this. So heavy. I'm, I'm playing jump rope in your head right now. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let me talk to you a second. I just want to tell you something between us. What I have here in my box, it's a stuffed animal. It's got a Freddy Krueger claw on it. Hat. It's a wrinkly dog. It's a wrinkly dog with a Freddy Krueger outfit on. Sound like my ex-boyfriend grandmother. <laughs> <laughs> might be. It might be. You wouldn't like to. You wouldn't like to a pregnant woman, wouldn't you? <laughs> I tell the truth. Oh. <laughs> I don't want to scare baby. I'm sorry, baby. I love you. I'm sorry. Uncle Jimmy is sorry. Uncle Jimmy loves you. Can you call me up? Can the baby call me Uncle Jimmy? If I give birth here, I will sue you. <laughs> I'm going to give you, you one, you one. Cardi B, everybody. But this one's called, uh, go the. <laughs> and I was just, do you know this one? I think what you should do is maybe, would you like to maybe read a, a few excerpts from this book? Maybe just give it a little practice. Just a little practice here. James, uh, can I get some like nice uh, mood setting music, uh, like baby, nighttime? Uh, 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 yeah. You know what? Um, wow, this is good. We don't need any lighting change here. This would be. Okay, I'm, I'm getting nervous now. Oh, I'm getting close to the. You are? I'm getting close to the D. Oh my God. Oh man, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be a mom. Okay. All right. The cats nestle close to their kittens. The lambs have laid down with the sheep. You are cozy and warm in your bed. My dear, please go the f to sleep. I want, I want to, for people at home that are getting to know you, uh, I know you have this, uh, you, you have very awesome ways of expressing yourself through different sound effects. And I think it's good to know what they are and what they mean so that everyone here in the audience and everyone at home and everyone around the world can talk to you and, you know, really express back to you. So I was wondering if you could help us out with that and just go through three of the words or sounds or things that, you, that you're famous for and just explain it to all of us, please. Do you mind? Sure. You could take it. This first one is eow. E eow. Oh, you know, that's like almost like a... Like a sad cat sound. <laughs> like a cat that's going through pain. Meow. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so wait, wait. Meow. 
Uh-huh, uh-huh. Now, uh, yeah, it's almost like a, like a, like a plane landing. <laughs> and what, and what situation would you be in for, for that to come out? Oh, you know, like when they tell you a good news, but it's good, but it's not exciting. Like it's like, oh, I have a new job. <laughs> uh, you guys ready to try it? Three, two, one. <laughs> okay, this is good. This is taking now. The second one is uh, same spelling. Uh, <laughs> this is this is eow. But it's higher? No, 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 no. Ow! <laughs> what, what, what is that one? <laughs> you know, like it's like oh, when you push. Ow! <laughs> no, how would how, how would I use this in a situation? Oh well, you know, it's just like, oh my god, I'm hosting the Jimmy Fallon show. <laughs> Roots, you want to try yow? Three, two, one. Yeah! <laughs> Very good, actually. All right. For this last one, uh, I think I know what this one's going to be. This one is. <laughs> someone, someone knows it. Someone's doing it. <laughs> So new. now this is this is uh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. No. You know, it's like a cold pigeon <laughs> in New York City. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, well, yeah, so now now now, now there's that different three different variations of a cur? Yes. And what would what would the what would like what would that uh, mean? It's just like, you know, like, it depends on the situation that you're in. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, if somebody checks somebody, oh, yeah. it's like, oh, <laughs> I know she had all of that in her. Oh, oh, oh I see. It's, it's, like, it's almost like, okay, but it's. Yeah, oh, yeah, okay, but okay is pay out. Okay. Yeah. Um, We've done that already. Yeah. We've done that already. Why do okay? You might as well go. Oh, yeah, okay, good. All right. Now we all learn. Thank you, Cardi B. This is fantastic. Now we know. <laughs>